Now, on first glance, you might think our next guests are just like any other family, but behind closed doors, they live quite an unusual life. Alongside their two young daughters, Snow and Pebble, JP Kenny and his partner, Kimmy Jeffrey, like to spend their spare time hunting for ghosts and attempting to speak with spirits. This has led to many people dubbing them the real-life Adams family, and they're arriving in our studio now to tell us more in their very unique family car. And here it comes. This is a first for this morning, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, many it's a, vehicles It's a here. worrying sight. <laughs> da 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 da. Ah. It's and a lovely the car. In the back. It's beautiful, isn't it? And here they are now. Welcome. We have got JP, Kimmy, and Snow and Pebble in the back of the car. Hello. Hi guys. Welcome. Hello. Welcome. Do you come and join us. Hello. Hi. Come and have a How seat on our sofa. Nice to see you. You look lovely, girls. Look at you, beautiful girls. Come and join Hi. us. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Nice to see you. That's quite the entrance. So that's there. what we've not had that before. <laughs> no, All sorts of cars that have come through those doors, but we've never had a hearse before. <laughs> yeah. We'll come to that in just a moment. So let's figure out, you know, what is going on here. Um, have you always had an interest in ghosts and spirits? Yeah. So since we've been young, haven't we, Kim? Since we've been young, we've always been called weird into the into the paranormal and into the ghosts but then we met each other yeah. and then obviously met someone with the same interest and it's just gone from there and it's grown from there and in yeah. fact you got very serious about it otherwise uh, after you bought some tickets and you went to go and see the, the uh, this sort of scary ghost hunt and you actually have now gone on to turn what is a real passion for the both of you into a business yeah yes it's the longest yes. birthday present ever <laughs> <laughs> you did very well you did very very well <laughs> So yeah. the company's been set up, and this is the Occult Hauntings. It certainly is. And um, what, what do you do? What's the, what's, what does the company do? So we, we offer ghost events, sleepovers, don't we? In, um, like, haunted mansions? Like, so, so the Orchards are a location that's kind of known to maybe yeah. be a bit yes. haunted. Yes. So it's all got history. Um, we don't learn about history till the clients go in, then we tell them the history, uh -huh. which is good. But um, they're all known to have paranormal activity. So we've been to quite a lot of places. So the first one was 30 East Drive, which is the most haunted um, did house you see in the Did anything happen? Well, that's where our little pink ghost come from, our little spirit yes, attachment. Ex explain the pink ghost. Yeah, so we've got um, a spirit attachment, which we see around the house. Yeah. Um, likes to play with all the toys. Likes to drain Pebble with the Barbies, <laughs> which is good for. Is it a young spirit? We think yes. it's a young girl, don't we? Oh, yes. you do? Yeah. Yeah, yeah a, young, a young child. So, so you actually see class her. this as, as being a sort of a third child, yes, really, yes. don't you? Yes. Yeah. And, and, and it, it be so attached that you think that the, it will be here now. It might be sitting next to you, Phil, <laughs> right, right behind you, or in between. Well, at least there's a seat. <laughs> <laughs> no, in between us. Yeah. yeah, she makes herself known. We can feel her presence. We don't know her name. Um, we've not spoken to her, but we do feel her presence. Like We've just got a new house, and in that new house, there's no history, but... Things happen, we hear footsteps, we see toys move and the ghost hunting equipment goes off. Really? Which is very interesting, <laughs> yeah. Well, so this is where the car comes in because you needed a second family car and you decided to buy this, which is the hearse. So, and you loved it so much so, it's so comfortable that you use it now all the time. What sort of reaction do you get? Because you take this to the supermarket, you've even gone through the McDonald's drive through <laughs> Yeah, I'll <laughs> let you do that because that's your shopping. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I take it shopping. I like to put a lot of my dresses in there. Uh, we take it on a weekly shop as well. Um, but lots of yeah. space, so it's yeah. quite practical. It, it is very, very practical. It gets all my shoes in there. And do people yeah. comment? Do people come out and take pictures? What sort so of reaction that's where we got the name from, the Real Life Adams. Right. So we were in Manchester one day, just driving down, as we do, near the pubs. Yeah. And then people just ran out and went, oh, it's the Real Life Adams family, how cool. <laughs> and that's stuck yeah. for the last few months. Yeah. And girls, what do, you, what do you think about the, that, that big thing being the family car? Fun. Yeah? Is it fun? Is it comfy? Yes. Is it? And, uh, and you've been out with um, your folks to these events. Is it not a bit scary? No. Why? Um, because we like doing our something because it's really fun and it's not even one bit scary. Not a bit <laughs> scary. Wow. And so when you go to these events, what sort of things do you see? Because can you sense if there's a ghost around? Well, I just uh, look around uh, because there, there's like, because uh, it like it looks like a bit creepy. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a creepy spirit, and then sometimes I see stuff. 
have you have you what sort of stuff have you seen because there are loads of programs on the telly that do the sort of ghost hunting type mm -hmm. of thing um <clears throat> and there's never been i to, to, to my knowledge one specific moment where where you had suddenly had the proof oh my goodness mm -hmm. There it is. There's a bang or a cupboard opens or whatever. Mm -hmm. So what have you seen that makes you think, yep, definitely there are ghosts? A round-headed soldier. Right. Uh, and uh, when we were somewhere else, we went, uh, we went to a bingo hall and I saw something um, peeking over and it looked black and it... It was uh, like weird. What, <laughs> like, weird. Uh, like, like a person? Uh, I don't know. It was like. <laughs> oh right. Okay. So what did, at you. What did what did you see at four crosses? So you saw the round-headed soldier, and then who else did you see near the toilets? A lady and a child, like holding hands, opening the toilet door. Wow. And what do your friends think? What do they say? Oh, cool. Yeah, <laughs> I bet. It's kind of cool. There are, there are obviously going to be people watching who'll say, mm, not appropriate to set your kids on stuff like this. What do you say to them? Well, we love it. And the girls love it. And the girls aren't scared. And they want to they, they wanna do it. You guys want to do it. And if you didn't want to do it, then we'd respect that as well. Mm. But why should they be scared? They shouldn't think, be scared. Yeah, I think it's good for the kids to grow up not having that fear. Yeah. Um, obviously, we don't do the Ouija boards and all the the top end stuff but we just go into different venues and we show them we might be spirits around and there's no no need to be scared no need to be scared yeah yeah um and so what about for you guys i mean is it is it you're going to obviously continue doing doing the business thing there's a documentary i think about you yeah we, yeah that's that's top secret at the moment <laughs> oh, <is it>? okay. <laughs> but yeah we've been contacted for a documentary so hopefully that'll air soon when we start filming just um, following our family around on Brilliant. ghost hunts. Um, Brilliant. Yeah. And your and friends and family all fully supportive? All fully supportive. They, it, they? they absolutely love it. Yeah. I mean, they must love the car. You think, actually, I've got a, <laughs> a single bed I need moving. Could you uh, come? Oh, yeah. <laughs> fitted in that. I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. They are, for, for the reason that they're made and the reason that they're there, it's a shame because they're such beautiful cars. They are lovely. They're they good, are good to drive, nice and Is smooth, it? really good to drive. Yeah. yeah. Um, bad on petrol. I'm <laughs> not on front. Yeah. Really expensive, big old, but big old car. <laughs> we love Morticia, so. That's her name. That's her name, <laughs> that's yeah, her name. yeah, that's her name. Um, thank you. It's lovely to meet all of you, especially you two. Thank you so much for coming. <laughs> thank you.